Hello everybody and welcome back to another Gary's Mod video. Boom. That's it. Hope you guys enjoyed. No, I'm just joking though, for real. Welcome back to another Gary's Mod video. I don't think we're alone here. Bam. Bam. Look, I did it so fast. You couldn't even see me. Put it away. Look, you, did, you didn't even see that one. Oh, 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 oh. Okay, what the hell am I doing right now? What am I doing with my life right now? I'm just kidding. But uh, welcome back to another Gary's Mod video. Today, we're checking out RP underscore. Don't forget the underscore. Dead City. So, uh, I don't know if this map is based off of anything in particular. But it looked very interesting on the Steam Workshop, so I said, hey, let's have a little download. Why don't we, why don't we have a little look-see here? Why don't we, why don't, why don't we, uh, why don't we see what this map's all about? There's a lot of weird noises in the background. While I am making weird noises, also known as the thing called talking. Not sure if you've ever heard of it. It's a common thing that human beings do. But, uh... Yeah, let's check this out. Let's go. Uh, can we go in here? Let's check it out, man. Ooh, we can go in here. This is a very well-designed map already, I can tell. Is that the building settling or gunshots? That's such a weird question to ask because I feel like you'd be able to tell the difference. But, uh, this building's so damn old, I wouldn't be surprised if it was the building settling. You know, I think I've played a bunch of maps made by this person. You guys should go support the map creator, by the way. Like, go in the description down below, you know. I'm gonna stand over by this fire. Okay, not in it, though. That hurts. Um, you guys should go in the description down below. And go support the original map creator. Uh, go give the map some Steam Awards. Freaking likes. A nice comment. Because, uh, stuff like that really helps the map creators out to show that you care and uh, if you like what I have to say in the video or about the map or whatever you can leave a like I don't care but what's more important is that you guys go support the original map creator this is a dangerous place to put a fire you know on the second floor in a building first of all with a wooden floor it's a little off the floor but I don't know, that's a little risky. I mean, I don't think you guys really have fire hydrants here. That are not expired. There's another one there. Look at this dude, he's like, boar. <laughs> Sorry. I'm, I'm really childish. He's like, boar. Can I take this chair? No. What could this mean, you guys think? Those are gunshots. That can't be the building settling. Actually, I still don't... I still can't tell the difference. I really can't. Because I'm stupid. But, uh, what is this? What, what does this mean? What could this possibly mean? Grandma? Is that you gasping for air? She's like, oh, you know what I'm saying? I'm just kidding. What's he pointing at though? I'm just kidding. Obviously we are not in America. So, uh, Look how cool this is though. Boom, iconic screenshot right there. Easily 10,000 views. For the thumbnail. There's a lot of fires really close by each other. I like it.
Don't ask me why I did that. I just, uh... Sometimes I do things I don't know why I do, you know? It just looks like this floor was purposely destroyed. <laughs> like the tiling was just hit with a sledgehammer or something. Oh, hell nah. We're gonna go in. We're gonna go in. Can we? I don't think it goes very far. Okay, never mind. This don't go far. And then it does go far. It do. Did I scare somebody? Let me know if I scared you. Did you shit and piss yourself, my brother? On my carpet. Is this where we started? I would not have been able to tell. Yes, we have, because I remember I hit the floor in this exact spot. You could see. Boom, I did it again. I like how I found the exact hole that I hit at the beginning of the map. <laughs> Alright, uh, let's go this way now. I love how this looks, by the way. I love that you can tell that things are just starting to start to, like, overgrow. And you can tell that they probably cut this grass all the time, you know? Before whatever happened here happened. Trees are starting to grow. This building's probably been abandoned for a lot longer than people think. This reminds me of that one place in New York that's like, uh just surrounded by the freeways and the guy who just refused to leave his home was that in new york oh i wonder what this would be i do gotta say i like what you've done with the place I gotta play Stalker. I don't know if this is related to Stalker, though. But it's kind of reminded me of, like, a Stalker map. People would be like, hey, this reminds me of Stalker. It reminds me of when people say it reminds them of Stalker. <laughs> Basically. Just some of the textures, at least. Also, this kind of feels like somebody would just be jogging. You know, this kind of feels like it was always, like, a military-related thing. Right here. Look at that fire. Look at that. Look how cool we are. You guys ever read that thing as a kid? As a kid, it's like the boy who jumped over the candle. That's me, but I'm jumping over the fire directly through it too, by the way. Not to mention. Like, I'm just jumping through that, bro. I feel like you could probably do that and get away with it. Like, maybe once. Not the candle, but like a fire like that. You know, if you're quick enough. Don't let yourself get caught. I would not recommend it, though. Don't do that. Okay. Because that's how people get burnt. And I'll, I'll tell you one thing. I've been burned a few times, and it doesn't feel pleasant, man. i got a few burn scars myself. It don't feel pleasant. And I'm not talking like oh itty bitty ones. Like I got I got a big I got a I got a burn scar, you know. That's the wood stove, man. When I was putting wood in it, my hand bumped the side of it and it was already lit. Like it, it was lit for like a few hours. My hand touched it. Freaking I got a boo-boo, man. Nothing helped me. You know. I just got a big old boo-boo. I got a boo-boo scar now. It looks like they just put, like, tiles up. 
Right there. It's kind of funny looking. Look at that tree, though. Disrespectful, bro. People are like, oh, if we let things grow on their own, surely they won't be dying on their own. Bro, look at this dumbass tree. Fell over. I don't think any person did that. I think that tree is just stupid as hell. That's so dumb. That tree probably just got old. I actually don't know. Do trees get old, y'all? Do trees get old and die? I'm sure they do, actually. I don't know why I'm asking that. I've seen dead trees. <laughs> do trees have heart attacks, though? That's the real question. Like, do they get in car accidents? Do they have heart failure? You know? One time when I was in class as a kid, my teacher was talking about, uh, you know, how people used to grow plants back in America, and then they're talking about how all, all these plants were dying at this one point in history, and then I just said, did they get run over? Everybody started laughing, and then my teacher said, listen, you say that again, I will kill you. Do you understand? I will kill you. I do not want any sarcasm in this classroom. I will end your pathetic little life. What does that say? Can somebody translate? And she she picked me up by my neck and started shaking me and said, Listen here, you little shithead. I'm just kidding. She did not say that. She Actually, I think she laughed too. <laughs> I love just spreading misinformation about people who have always been nice to me in my life. I gotta say, I really am curious on what this would look like before. Like, look at how... That's just such a pretty green color. The fact it's still that bright green now is just like... I bet that was a cool-ass bathroom, you know? It is small, though. Take one of these? No? Well then fuck off. I wanna see this place over here. Look how old this one is. There's a lot of these around. We're gonna light them all up too, baby. Yeah, baby. Look at how cool the forest surrounding this place is. Oh man. This bob wire is really depressing though. You can tell that this was probably a town that was like I don't know, in the middle of a war that just kind of, you know, didn't turn out well for them. For the townspeople, or this was just a military camp that was once a town. It kind of just makes me feel like they're keeping people here as, like, prisoners or something. That's so cool. You know, I've seen bathrooms like this. I don't know what they're for. Are they for, like, handicapped people? Or is this just a thing that I've never seen, like, heard of? I've seen them here in America, though. So I think they might be, like, a handicapped one, but I, don't, I could be wrong. I haven't seen them, like, in a public place. I've seen them at, like, schools and stuff, you know. They're bathrooms like this. But, uh, this makes you kind of wonder. I mean, obviously it was for peeing in, I'm sure. It was not poop compatible, I'm positive. 
Although some kids probably did poop in it, to be honest with you. People freaking, when I was a kid, pooped in like urinals. It was disgusting. People did that shit in high school too. It was nasty. I don't know what the fuck's wrong with people. Especially kids, man. Hey, I mean, there's nothing wrong with being a kid. Just don't be that kind of kid. You know, don't be pooping in urinals. But enough with that. I'm sure somebody does not like that topic. Oh, look at that. You gotta get close up to see through there. That's really cool. That's hella unique. I really love this map, actually. This is so well made. I love uh, the vibe I get from this school in particular. It's a vibe, you know? Sorry if I miss some buildings that have a lot of the same rooms, you know? Oh, okay, my spray didn't show up. That's okay. I'm just gonna cry now. Or I'm just gonna place another one down. Look, I left my mark. Okay, let's keep going. Some kind of checkpoint here, it looks like. We cannot go that way. As you can see, I feel like this is kind of, this kind of reminds me of a cemetery in a weird way, but it's just like a, kind of nice park. Obviously we've been there by the fires. That was a new sound, it sounded like someone just got shot closer by. Yeah, we can't really go up there, so I've no clipped a little bit, sorry. Have you looked at everything here? What's this place? We've been here. We've been there. I think we've been in here. I think we've explored a lot of this. This is a really cool ass map though. I do have to say, I love it. We've been in these buildings, these little rooms here. I think we've been in here. Yeah, because this just kind of led to another area with more rooms like that. Yeah. Uh, have we been in here, though? I think I saw it, but I don't know if we went in. Obviously, we have not. Here walking around, you saw this many fires around. You'd assume that there'd be somebody at least watching you, and that is just the worst. That that beats all the rest of them. That's the worst one. That's literally just gonna start a fire. That's gonna start the building on fire. I mean, that is concrete to be fair, but still. Are these walls concrete? Okay, maybe then it isn't so bad, but the smoke, man. I, I mean, to be fair, all these windows, there's like... No glass in them, so... I guess it's not that bad. Cool building. It's so cool to see all the fires like that. See, if I saw that just walking around, I would know that I was being watched. Cause ain't no way in hell somebody's gonna leave a nicely lit fire like that alone in a you know survival situation. They knew you were coming, and they're watching you. They smell you. They see you. Look how! Oh my gosh! Can we even see this building from anywhere around here? You can't even see it from here, then why did they put that building there? They must have been... You know, I guarantee that there's going to be more to this map. 
Just look at this. Look how huge it is. Look, there's even like little poles here. I love finding stuff like this because I don't think we can see that from. We can't even see the building from here, which is already out of bounds, right? Like, this is as close as we can get to it, really. Wait, we can always jump over that? Wait, what? Does it just let me get over there then? Oh no, this is where it stops. Like, even if I zoom in, you can't even see it. So that just kind of makes you wonder, you know? Look, here's another building. It's really nice, though, to know that there's just so much attention to this map. Unless he was, like, the type of person that even wanted to add stuff out of bounds so people, like, it, it felt more alive. But look at this, you know? It kind of looks like there's a trail that was going to lead around this place or something. I, or, no, this is just more textured grass. Never mind. This is, like, the grass that you can get close up to. Makes you wonder. I'm gonna mess with the fog here. Just kind of get rid of it. It's gonna look a little weird with everything spawning in in front of us because there's supposed to be fog. But uh, I wanted to have a little look at this. See, this is what it's like without fog. This is what it's like with it. That's just really nice. Fog actually helps a lot too. Look, can we even see it without the fog here? Oh, well, this is as far as we can go there. I might be at the wrong uh, entrance, so maybe across here? There's my mark. We have not been in here. I, I love this map, man. I'm in love with the fact that there's, like, out-of-bounds stuff. This is what we saw. Okay, so we can actually see them without the fog pretty decently here. But when we turn that on, you can kind of see it. But it's just like a silhouette of it, you know? But you wouldn't really even know that there's a building there in the first place. So you could tell that this guy was building without the fog on, so you don't really get to see the buildings, I guess. You know, but I I love that man, so cool. Look at all these detail. I I tried putting a little thing back there, but it didn't, it didn't work. I love this map, dude. Though, dude, it's very well designed. Um, this would be a really fun roleplay map. There's a lot of places where you could, admins can just take you to an admins. It, yeah, they got a little bit of the sewer. What's down here? Huh? Attention, stalkers! An emission is approaching. I repeat, an emission is approaching. Seek cover immediately. Excuse me? Okay, so... Attention, stalkers! An emission will start any minute now. Find cover if you want to live. Interesting. Okay, I don't know how to stop this. I'm just hoping that it's gonna stop on its own. Stalkers, the emission is finally over. I hope you're all in one piece. The one piece? Is it real though? Okay, um. Day color, huh? Okay, so it seems like it changes that. I want to see the night color, though. 
Oh, nice. That's pretty. I don't know what PSI does. But uh, I will say that is bright as hell. So obviously that's meant for the admins. Oh. I am, uh... I'm sorry if you're watching this at night and you're just being blinded. I'm being blinded and it's the middle of the day, so... Um, I guess that's it for this. I hope you guys enjoyed. I'm gonna end this one here. If you guys wanna check out whatever this stuff means, um, obviously I'm not intelligent enough to understand basic things, so... Um, if you wanna check this out, please do. You know, so obviously this is related to Stalker. Um, as it is confirmed. It's really freaking pretty though, man. There's a lot to this map and I really like that. I wanna check out the skybox, so... Like, look at this huge skybox. That's cool, man. Kind of creepy here as well, too. But, uh, look at my little legs going. I hope you guys enjoyed this as much as I did. If you guys want to check out all this stuff, please do. Um... I might have missed some things, so. This is just a tunneling system that leads underground. This is so cool, man. Love this map. I hope you guys enjoyed, though, and uh, I don't really got much else to say, except please go support the original map creator. And that is it for this one. Peace out, be safe, and goodbye. Thank you guys so much for watching.